Welcome back everyone Grosjean here and today we are going to be having a look at Left Behind. Now the, the description for this game says that it's a hyper realistic psychological horror. So let's jump in and see what we get. You can use your microphone in the game. This mechanic can be employed while reading subtitles to simulate the experience that you are in that scene and you are the one experiencing these scenarios. Simply hold down the alt key while speaking into your microphone then release the alt key when you finish talking. This feature can also be used to interact with the entities but keep in mind that this is an optional mechanic and cannot, Im cannot impact the actual story and flow of the game. It's designed solely for the immersive and realistic gameplay. All right, we'll have a look at that. So continue. This game doesn't have controller support, so it looks like we are on mouse and keyboard today, which is probably good. Date January the 15th, 2006. You receive a call from a potential property seller. The mentioned property is quite affordable. So as a real estate agent, you seize the opportunity and proceed to the specified location for a property inspection. Location somewhere in the woodland rural, rural area. Client's name, Mr. William. Okay, so we are going to go and see Mr. William's house and see if it's something that we'd like to buy and sell, I guess, <laughs> or rent out. But we are driving through. It kind of looks picturesque, doesn't it? February the 26th, 2006, 5 18 pm. So what did they say? Hold down, Alt. This must be the place I was looking for. And do nothing. The client did provide me with the precise location of the building. He mentioned that this is a truly special building. I'm curious about what he means by special. Right. So the sun is setting and we are heading out into a forest, which is always a good idea, right? Always a good idea. Let's get out the car and see where we go. So it looks like we are walking from here. It's a battered old car, isn't it? But a real, real estate developer or whatever we are. I mean, you'd expect a nicer little vehicle than this. But we just drove down that, right? Yeah, we can't drive through that little section. Oh, it's an old Ford. An old Ford car. Bit of an antique. Big aerial on the front. Nice little river down the bottom. This is quite a nice little place for... Quite a nice little place for ourselves to have... Uh, you know, somewhere to live. We can hear birds squeaking in the background. Wind rustling through the trees. And we are taking a nice little slow hike. We can run a little bit, but it's really slow. And we've got like a rickety old bridge. He said that the house is somewhere around here. He said that the house is somewhere around here. <laughs> oh, where does that? That just repeated what we said. Let's cross this rickety old bridge. Let's cross this rickety old bridge. Oh my God, I sound so bad. I sound so bad. Okay. Do you think our truck would have fitted across there? Maybe, maybe. Wouldn't look too close to that water though. You'd be needing to pee all the time. The sun is going down. The light shining through the trees. God rays are quite cool in it as well. Nothing like the birds tweeting. Nothing like the birds tweeting. Well, this is going to be bedtime by the time we even get there. I really hope I don't come across any bears or wild animals. I really hope I don't come across any bears or wild animals. I mean, I don't know what part. I'm guessing we're in America. I'm guessing. It's a bit of a swampy little looking area. This looks like the place where we're going to die. This looks like the place where we're going to die. <laughs> Alright, well, looks like we've got to get our feet wet. We're going to have some soggy shoes. We're going to have some soggy shoes. I'm curious about why the seller is deciding to sell this property. I'm curious about why the seller is deciding to sell this property. I don't know how often I'm going to keep doing that. It's just kind of fun. <laughs> oh, yeah, our truck definitely wouldn't have got up this path. Although, it looks like there's been vehicles up and down here before maybe just like little quad bikes and stuff the graphics are really nice adds to the immersion doesn't it being able to oh you got mushrooms little uh, do you reckon they're poisonous right we have come to a road we can go right or we can go left which way do we want to go let's go left let's go left or we could just go straight up I don't know there's no signpost or anything oh look at that that tree there it looks like a hand. Well, we can't go that way. Let's go back the other way. 
But we came down that big, up that big hill. We came up the big hill. This looks like a swamp. This is an excellent location for a property to be, to be developed. It's cozy and relaxing. This is an excellent location for a property to be, to be developed. It's cozy and relaxing. Hope there's no crocs in that water. Hope there's no crocs in that water. Am I doing it right? <laughs> right, we are... We're, there's something in the distance over there. Something, we're coming up to something. We're not in the middle of nowhere no more. Oh, look at that waterfall. Oh, look at that waterfall. Hold on a second. Is that a campsite? It seems like someone else is living here. Hold on a second. Is that a campsite? It seems like someone else is living here. Oh, wait. It appears as though it's been left here for quite some time. Oh, wait. It appears as though it's been left here for quite some time. Well, I can spend some time here while searching for that property. Well, I can spend some time here while searching for that property. I don't know whether I'd really want to sleep in the tent here, though. So what are we going to do? Just, um... Oh, we got a bridge up there. We've got little uh, mosquito net things. Can we do anything? Can we interact? Ouch, my head hurts for some reason. I should take a short nap in this tent before continuing. Ouch, my head hurts for some reason. I should take a short nap in this tent before continuing. Start a fire and sleep. What was that noise? Start a fire and sleep. Let's eat to start a fire. Oh, something just a tree's just appeared. Look at that. It disappeared and appeared. <laughs> right, press E to rest. Right, we are gonna have a nap. We are gonna have a nap. Get a good sleep. Wake up in the morning. Go off to view this property. We got wolves. Oh god, I overslept. What time is it? What time is it? It's not it's not time to get up yet. Go back to sleep. Did he listen? No, no, he didn't. Alright, so we got a little torch. Fuck, I should go back to my car. It's so freaking dark. Fuck, I should go back to my car. It's so freaking dark. Okay. So we came this way. And then there was a... There was a hill going down. What a foolish mistake to sleep in a stranger's tent. What a foolish mistake to sleep in a stranger's tent. This does look kind of realistic, doesn't it? The camera... I like the way the torch moves. I don't remember coming down this big hill, though. Maybe we did. I don't know. There's some creepy-ass noises in here. Oh, if something jumps out on me now, I'm probably going to shit myself. <laughs> oh, if something jumps out on me now, I'm probably going to shit myself. It's a bit creepy being here all alone. It's a bit creepy being here all alone. Alright, let's get moving. We don't want to stay in here too long. Hey, okay, so there's that tree with like the that looked like a hand. So we want to go down this pathway. We can still see the fire over there to our left. Oh, what the hell is that? We should have come in the morning. We should have come in the morning. We don't want to. Come and play out in the dark. I'll resume my search for that property tomorrow, I suppose. I'll resume my search for that property tomorrow, I suppose. This is a bit of a steep hill. Where's our bridge? I'm sure. What the fuck is that? I don't want to turn around. Right, we came through this. I think... I don't know. I don't remember. Yeah! Oh, shit! What the hell? <laughs> oh, we need to find our car. Got proper shivers then. That grass looks like snakes. It's so dark. H, locate your car. Oh. Oh. We just set the alarm off. Hey, let's go. We're running through the forest now instead of on the path. Couldn't get... Oh, where did that house come from? 
Sounds like a egg growl. Do we want to check our car or the house? Oh, God, I don't know. Let's go to the car. Oh, what happened then? Uh, I'm disoriented. Where was the house? There. There's the house. Our car was over this side. That's another one. Where am I? I'm certain. Oh, where am I? I'm certain this is the way back. But how did this building appear here? Where am I? I'm certain this is the way back. But how did this building appear here? It's getting closer. Right, let's go and check the front door. What if this property that the seller was telling me about? What if this property that the seller was telling me about? Right, that door is blocked, says staff only. This is a mad house in the middle of a forest, it's huge. Oh, psychiatric hospitals. Well, that's kind of creepy. That's kind of creepy. It's locked. Okay. Of course. Of course it's locked. Hmm. Right. I've got a crowbar in the car. I should go and get it. Of course it's locked. Hmm. Right. I've got a crowbar in the car. I should go and get it. it said to press H before to locate the car, right? But we can't. Oh, there's our bridge again. That wasn't there before. All right. Let's get down the side of the house. Go and find our car. Did we walk this far before? We can't press that again. But I'm sure the car was just here. Oh my god, where's my car? I swear I parked it here. I should go back to that building. Make oh my your mind god. up. Where's my car? I swear I parked it here. I should go back to that building. The mic sounds a little bit crackly. I don't know whether it's me. Or <laughs> am I just talking too close there? All right, let's get back. But we know we can't get in there. The door was locked. Unless there's a, another door. Birds need to stop making that noise. Right, there's some underground rooms there. Looks uh, kind of creepy already. I don't like this already. I don't like this already. I don't know why I do this to myself. Our running speed is worse than Phasmophobia. Oh, the lock's gone off the door. We're going in. We're going in. Right. So we got some hallways. This place looks so old and creepy. I wonder how I walked past this huge building earlier. This place looks so old oh. and creepy. I wonder how I walked past this huge building earlier. <laughs> That's so good. Oh, mouse. I move left mouse button to open doors. F to toggle the floor. Oh, we don't want to We don't want to turn that off. We don't want to turn that off. Right, I guess the office is the first place we should check. Alright, right, so we have to drag the handle. In here, we got medical records. A pan. Some glass jars. A lighter. Can we not collect anything in here? No. We got a broken computer. Let's take it. A key. We can't select the key. Oh, that's a shame. We should have picked that up. All right, so it looks like we are going somewhere else. All the electrical wires. This place is a mess. This place is a mess. All right, we got some stairs we can go up. Just check this other door over here first. What the hell is that? Oh, it's a neck. Like all the arteries and stuff. Right, that door doesn't open. Of course it doesn't. What about the light switch? Nah, that don't work either. Right, do we want to go up or check downstairs? Should we go and check the other end first and then we'll go upstairs? It takes so long running. Right, someone looks like they were going to start plastering the walls and got, like, uh, scared. I don't know. I don't know. Right, we got stairs on this side too. And a couple more doors. That one's blocked off. This one is the director's office. We can't go in there either. Okay. Should we go up this set of stairs then? Since it's the closest one, so he's walking all the way back. Hello? Is anyone here? Hello? Is anyone here? <laughs> I don't even know what to do. I don't know what to do because, of course, there's no one here. What am I thinking? Of course, there's no one here. What am I thinking? 
Right, we got a door there. Perform procedures. Another one that doesn't open. That doesn't open. Right, we got a door to the left, a door to the right. So let's go left first. Nope, nope, nope. And that one doesn't open either. This is creepy. The Just the atmosphere is so creepy. Oh, yeah, the echo when we turn our torch off and on it as well. Right, it looks like we're going to have to go downstairs and go back to that other side. That little wire just nearly made me jump a little bit then. Down the stairs. Hello? Hello? Have we got another one of them pictures there showing the insides of the bottom half? Can anybody hear me? Can anybody Where? hear me? I thought that didn't work for a second then. Right, so. Oh, it was the stairs we were going to. Not that one. Right, let's get up. Let's get up. Looks like the ceiling's been falling down. Yeah. This place is in great shape. Oh, shh. Mannequin. Mannequin. Okay, well, we've been everywhere we can actually go. <laughs> we can't get anywhere. Right, did we check that door at the end? Was that door even there before? Let's just press some buttons to see if there's anything that we're missing because our torch is looking really dim. Right, we must have missed them. I'm sure we should be able to pick that key up, maybe. But we, I couldn't get it. No, can't pick nothing up. Medicine's still here, though. Just been playing the mortuary assistant where you can pick up loads of stuff. And unless you can't pick anything up. A lighter would have kind of been useful. We could set like a little fire and have a bit of light somewhere. Okay, let's go back to the door. See if... It doesn't look like there's anywhere we can go in here. Uh-oh. We can't go out either. We're locked in. We're locked in. So it looks like... We'll try this door again. If not, we'll go upstairs and see if there's something that we can do up there. That one's got locked. It's got a, an actual lock on it. We said the whole left mouse button to open and close doors, which isn't working. Alright, so up we go, up we go. Where's the way out? I'm scared. Where's the way out? I'm scared. Right, I can't see anything that we can do. And they're creepy noises though. Ah, door is locked. I need to press E. I need to press E, no. Okay. That's what I'm doing. That one doesn't say nothing, though. Okay, try this one. What's that one say? Punishment cell. But we can't do nothing with that one. Here we go, it said E interact. We interacted with the key. I hope this key works. I hope this key works. But this is taking me a fair bit longer than I was expecting because <laughs> I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Right, we're gonna go upstairs anyway. Let's see. Now there was another room next to that office where we probably should have Oh saying that this one was locked, wasn't it? We might be able to use the key in this one. Oh, yeah, there we go. We managed to unlock a door. Right, that's kind of creepy. There's a bath with um, things on there to tie their hands. And I've, got, I've just got goosebumps on it. I don't know why. Read the notes. What notes? Okay. Make candles glow in shadows near. Lights all gone. Darkness clear. In the corners embrace. Secrets unfold. Speak the words and let the tale be told. 
Make candles glow in shadows near. Lights all gone, darkness clear. In the corners embrace, secrets unfold. Speak the words and let the tale be told. Right, well, apart from the notes, it seems like there's nothing in here for us. But there was another door over there that we might be able to unlock. Or oh, both of these, actually. This one doesn't let you interact with it. What about the... What was this one called? The punishment cell. No, no. Can't do nothing. Right, guess we're going. Do you think I should check that room? Just make sure I never missed anything. We've read the notes. That is all that is in here. That is all that is in here. Can we see ourselves in the mirror? Nah, it's a little bit dirty. Oh, there's a big knife. Can we take the knife? Kind of feel a bit safer with it. Alright, let's go down. But we can't open any of these doors. Can't interact with anything else there. <gasps> we can interact with the lighter. This lighter better have some fluid left in it. This lighter better have some fluid left in it. So it looks like it's just the angle that we're looking at. You've got to make sure you... See, you don't have a cursor on your screen, which makes it kind of hard. And now do we use the lighter? And what do we use it on? Phone? BT pay phones? Is this English? Or do you have BT in America? I don't know. Oh, we're back at this room and we can light the candle now. But why? Then, so what now? Then, so what now? You can use your microphone when saying words. You can use Do your we... microphone when saying words. But we might need to read the note now. What was that? Make the candles glow in the shadows near. Lights all gone, darkness clear. In the corners embrace, secrets unfold. Speak the words, let the tale be told. Tu qui oblitus et s nuc liber est. Tu qui oblitus s nuc liber est. Tu qui oblitus s. Oh yeah, whatever. Tu qui oblitus et s nuc liber est. Tu qui oblitus s nuc liber est. Tu qui oblitus s. Oh yeah. Whoa, what's up with the light? Whoa, what's up with the light? So what's supposed to happen now? This is boring. I should go home. So what's supposed to happen now? This is boring. I should go home. I've been thinking the same thing. <laughs> ah, shit. No, things are happening. God, that sounded like a door unlocked, didn't it? It was not one of these ones. I was saying something about in the corner, the truth will be told. That gave me goosebumps. Right, let's go and see what that noise was. Against me better judgment. Let's go and see what that noise was. Let's go and see what that noise was. Was that wheelchair there before? Can't do that. I'm sure that wasn't there. I don't remember seeing it. Oh, the front door's been boarded up. Hello, who did this? Hello, this is not a funny joke. Hello, who did this? Hello, this is not a funny joke. Right, I reckon we're going to go up them stairs now, but I'm just going to double check that this door didn't get locked. <laughs> I'm just gonna check this door didn't get opened. Nope, nothing we can do there. So, the other set of stairs it is. The other set of stairs, right. The mannequins are still there. It's still blocked off. Still blocked off, so where do we go? Can we go back in the office? Anything in here? 
Nothing. But the only... We went under there before, and that, that definitely wasn't there. That definitely wasn't there. We checked that, didn't we? And that door... Has got a padlock on it. Okay. Well, let us in one room. Any room is fine. I don't care which one. Looks like we've got to go back up again, doesn't it? Looks like we've got to go back up. Did we miss something in that room? What the hell? Hello? Who's there? Hello? Who's there? I don't like this. It comes from downstairs, right? What did it? I don't know. Might be up here. Might be up here. I don't know which way to look. <laughs> I don't know which way to look. We're going to try all these upstairs. Oh, uh, no. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. We got a candle in here, at least there's some light. Hills. The music's getting creepier. Are we not going in that one? Oh, can we not do anything? Can we not do anything? Feels like there's something up here that we got to do because this is where the noises are. I mean, the lights and everything are coming from. What about the cabinet? I don't know whether we checked in there. I can hear clicking. All right, we can't go down the gaps. We can't get around the back of there. We've read the notes. We've read the notes. Read them again. Oh shit The mannequins are here <laughs> Where did they come from? I wonder if there's a gap up the other one now and There's a toilet as well, was that here before? Oh Oh shit Where's she gone? It's different It's different, we can't go through that way no more Oh, the, the door's open. Right, there's notes on the table. Read the notes. I don't want to put myself through this, but I feel like I don't have any other choice. It seems like the right thing to do, at least for me. I'm hoping I'm making the right decision. Oh, dear Lord, please help me. I don't want to put myself through this, but I feel like I don't have any other choice. It seems like the right thing to do, at least for me. I'm hoping I'm making the right decision. Oh, dear Lord, please help me. We got a bolt cutter. What's that? We've read the notes, but I want to know what that is on the side of the table. Oh, it's just like one of them little tick, 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 tick things. <laughs> like, I don't know what it's called. <laughs> I don't know what it's called. All right, so we got a bolt cutter. We might be able to escape this place. Oh, I thought that was a way out. Right, a punishment cell on ward number six. You go to the punishment cell first? No? Enter room. Oh. And things go bump in the night. Right, we are in a punishment cell. There's something like a... Remember them drills they used to... Uh, it depends how old you are, actually. We used to get these little wooden drills. I, I got a woodworking kit when I was a kid. And you'd just stick it in the piece of wood and you'd spin it. Oh, shit. You'd spin it like that and hold it. And you'd drill the holes that way. Right, there's loads of pills left here. Nothing there. <gasps> Can we take that, please? Please, please. We don't want to leave it for someone else. 
Okay, we got another key. A surgery room key? It is kind of like a drill, like what I was thinking. But, right, there's nothing else in here. Thank God. <laughs> oh, that one's already open. Oh! oh shit! Oh, what is that thing? Oh, what is that thing? Ah! <laughs> God! Did we die? Did we die? <laughs> It's locked again. It's locked again. See, I knew we should have picked that up. Right. Surgery room key. Right, that door's shut. It says punishment cell. Perform procedures. Maybe it's not the right key. I don't know. I don't know, but let's see if we can get out that door. Oh, we can. Right, we've been in the director's office. It looks like we're going back upstairs again. Right, this episode's getting a little bit longer than I was planning, but I was messing, I was walking around back and forth for ages, so I'm probably cut a bit out. <laughs> right, is this the surgery room? Perform procedures? Oh no, that's the, that's the room with the candle in. But it wasn't that one. That was the punishment cell. We can't go in that one. I don't know what that thing was that chased us though. Right, we can't go in there, so it looks like we've got to go back downstairs. Oh, the mannequins are gone as well. Let's just double check there's nothing changed in here. No, it all looks the same. Let's get down these stairs. So yeah, there was the two mannequins there. See, even my dogs are freaked out. I can hear them barking. Hang on. Oh yeah, that's where we've been. So we've been in this room, right? Yeah, that's just appeared on the table. Can't open none of the drawers and stuff. There's nothing else to interact with on this table. Human psychology. Don't want to read the bloody notes. Don't want to read the bloody notes. But we're missing something. We're missing something. Because we can't unlock any of these doors. Right? So we've got to find something. Ward number six. What was the key for? It was the procedure room or something? I don't know. But there's loads of stuff that I wish we could pick up. What's that say? I can see what people are thinking. I really wish we could pick that up. If we picked that up before, we would have been alright before when that thing came. There's some creepy ass family. Oh, there's the key again. Surgery. Oh, I think we got killed. I think we got killed. Or oh, did we? <gasps> run, 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 run. Ah, get away. It's coming, it's coming. Oh, is it dead end? Is it? Is it? Is it? We need to go, we need to go, we need to go. Oh, no way. We need to find a surgery room, I think. It's a dead end. <laughs> Jesus. What the hell just happened? What the hell just happened? Where are we? Where are we? Where are we? Our torch doesn't work. Oh my god. Have we got a candle? Uh, 
But we can't go that way. You know what? I think that this is going to be a good place for us to finish off our episode. Scared the shit out of me at the end. Um, but I don't know whether this game saves or if you carry on or not. So we'll have to wait and see on that when the, when we come back. Or when I come back. Because, But if we do have to do it again to do this part. Oh, this is the other section that we haven't been up. For all the mannequins, this is the other section that we haven't been up to. Um, I don't know where we're going here. I'm just walking. You know what? I was ready to end. But I'm kind of having thoughts of maybe just like, deleting the game. <laughs> like these have moved. I think these have moved. What the hell is going on? I can hear something. And I thought I seen something move then. What the hell is going on? What the hell is going on? I don't think that one was there before. We can't push them or nothing. Right, there's nothing to read, nothing to do, nothing, nothing, nothing. I kind of just whizzed through it the first time because I was a little bit panicky. You ever play a game and you think, why? Why? That one's been buried a little bit. Hey, these are by a door. Oh, is this not where we... Hang on. That says surgery. <gasps> oh, he just opened it. I think. We opened the surgery door. Read the notes. I want to finish this. I've lost everything. I don't have anyone or anything left. Everyone and everything is gone. It's all up to me now. So perhaps this is the end. Maybe it's truly over. I want to finish this. I've lost everything. What if this property at the cellar is... What? What if this is the property... What? what if this property at the cellar is... What? What if this is the... Wait, there's someone outside. I need to ask for help. Wait, there's someone outside. I need to ask for help. Go to the window. Help. 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 We see lights outside. Guess I've really got to finish up soon. Guess I've really <laughs> got to finish up soon. Let's try this door one more time. No. I'm gonna go back around. Back around that way. Lights, lights, lights. Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Hello? Hey, up here, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Hello? Hey, up here, can you hear me? I feel like I'm in pure panic mode at the minute. Oh shit. Ah! <laughs> that weren't the guy we were. Thingy. Thingy. Uh, yeah. That weren't the person that we were looking for. Oh, we've got to keep going. We've got to keep going. What the hell is it? Doors locked. Doors locked. I can't get out. Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? I don't know what the fuck is happening. I don't know, but that is where we are going to finish off. There's a light there, though. <gasps> There's someone there. Well, we'll wait to meet him in the next episode. But everyone, thank you so much for watching. Really does mean a lot. Hope you enjoyed the episode. If you're new to the channel, if you are enjoying it, please hit that subscribe button. If you enjoyed the episodes, hit the thumbs up, pop some comments down below, let us know what you think. I want to say a big thank you to all the people who signed up on the Patreon and joined as members. It really does mean a lot. Thank you so much. And we'll see you in the next one. Thanks, everyone. Bye.